Hey everybody, how's it going? Hey, Duane Baker, how are you? Today we're gonna show you around Alma, Missouri. Kind of show you the farm stuff that's been going on. Hey, Sickbert model, how are you? Uh, so this is the farm. This is the starting farm, but I went ahead and altered it big time. We'll shut the door so the cows don't get out. But yeah, these are, so this is my barn, obviously, that I built. And then this is the one with the additional uh, f small freestyle barn uh, attached to it as well. Um, for some extra, more area for cows. You're playing Alma right now? Yeah, it's a good map. I'm really liking this map. And then this is the small steer heifer barn. I think I got my little bull calves in here, um, making all kinds of manure. But it does seem like everything kind of clicks together nicely. I didn't really plan this out. I just kind of placed them, placed them down. Uh, then I made this small cow pasture uh, off to the side here. I'm doing good, Duan. How are you? Uh, then this barn is the little... This has got our heifers in it. This barn's now. Hopefully you guys have seen this. Barn's out on the mod hub now. On the official in-game one, so... Uh, if you want this barn, you can go out and get it. Yeah, you like this? Yeah. Um, so this will be the next one that will go in for testing. Uh, I've been I've been adding a lot of different new details to it. This is probably the first time anybody's seen these kind of details added. But so we got bales in the hayloft. We'll kind of add in our flight mode so we can see. We got some hay, some straw bales. You won't be able to get in the hay mow because I don't really have room for the steps, and uh, I don't know how to make it so you can jump up in the hay mow. Hey there, Kyle. How are you? But anyhow, so when you get bales up in uh, Hayloft, you can come to this bale board. This is kind of something I came up with, a bale board. So you stop here to get bales from the Hayloft. If you hit R, uh, you can select from the hay and the straw. Uh, it'll only take little bales. But let's say we want to get some hay bales down, so then our hay bales spawn right here. So then you can grab them and you can feed the cows or you can uh, throw them in your mixer, whatever you want to do. Hey, plus video downloaded that cow shit last night. It's a fantastic barn. Yeah, this will. Uh, hopefully, it, you guys won't have this edition just yet. I'm just trying to get the initial passing, but you'll have this barn. It's still in testing. They want me to take the cows out of the parlor, but I'm trying to fight with them to keep them in. Because I I just think it's it's worth having them in. So yeah, hopefully this barn passes soon. I'm gonna guess it's not gonna be tomorrow because it's not in, uh, testing yet. But anyhow, back to this building. So yeah, so we got the bail board here, and then here we have the hayloft lights. So I've added two lights, uh, the electrical conduit, bo junction boxes, lights up there. So if we come here and turn turn the lights on. And those lights will turn on. And then we can turn it off. Lights come off. And then over here we have the main barn lights. Which are going to be the lights underneath the hayloft there. Uh, I should have made this bunk just a little bit shorter so you can jump in there. But if you go around it will turn these lights on. Uh, we get hung up. There we go. How's work this week, Kyle? And then the only other thing I gotta do yet is animate the windows. So I added these windows for some airflow for the cows. So I need to get them added in. Uh, yet I don't have that done. Uh, then yeah, this is the cow barn you guys all have now. Hopefully you like it. 
I wish it could make more things color changeable, like the trim and the gates, like I have, but I'll probably release it. I'm doing good, Kyle. What failed? Well, no, it didn't fail. What they want me to do is take the cows out of the milking parlor. They don't understand why I have them in there, but I have them in there to try to simulate real life milking times and how cows go in the parlor for milking. So, yeah, then this is just a continuation of the pasture here. We'll kind of fly up. You guys can kind of get a little overview. We got this little little pasture here for the cows. I got, uh, I think, like eight heifers out here. Um, and then I took the... Yeah, they sent it back for some stupid things. But... We'll get hope we'll get there. So I this is the shed in the bar, in this map. I just turned it red so it would match. Um, but we got our planter, our our plant planters. This is our bean planter. This is our corn planter. Uh, I got the AC disc, AC cultivator, or chisel plow there. You wouldn't believe some Peyton some of the things they sent it back for. Uh, we got our 12 row folding head for the gleaner. And then this is another shed that was white. I turned it red just because I wanted it uh, to match everything. And then we got our some of our haying equipment in here, which we're going to have to get out because we are mowing hay currently. We're doing a lot of things currently, actually. We got the Alice down there on the round baler. You can see I got a jump on quick con Kyle. For... <laughs> yeah. So we got the round baler. He was been going... Um, I got this Eggco, a newer Eggco here on the wagons. That's what been our main tillage and horsepower tractor. Uh, we got the 8D10, I believe, over there on uh, Rooster's new wagons. He's so been so kind to let me test out. Yeah, heffa. And then we got the Gleaner. Of course, we got the Gleaner. And we got the D21. Let's just hop down here. This guy's about done. Let's let him finish up. Uh, yeah, it should be. All right. He needs more offset. There we go. So he should be able to finish up there. Uh, this is Alma, Missouri. Christopher, this is on the in-game mod hub. Uh, they let you stream still. I'm doing pretty good, THG. How are you doing? Um, okay, let's get this going. Let's move. Well, let's just do this. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, this is Rooster's Wagons. He's been so kind to let me test them out, see if I can find anything with for them. So far, I haven't. They've been, which you guys can guess, he pretty much gets everything top notch. I know I turned my volume down, so let me know if this is too loud. Yeah, this is a sweet wagon. There's a lot of customizations on the wagons. You think you release your caption with a color selection? Yeah, uh, I probably will. I, I plan to just uh, have the mod hub one out for a while, and then I'll probably uh, release the one I have with all the customizations. Hey, Bryce, how you doing? Or simulation, how you doing? You like the cow barn? Good. I'm glad you guys are liking it. Uh, we're up over 10,000 downloads, which is pretty big. I didn't really know how things would go with it. Yeah, 10,000 so far, Kyle. Well, over 10,000. We're running a five-star rating, so I'm really, really happy with that, guys. It's been pretty good. Uh, I think we're running out of room. Oh, okay, yeah. Um... Shoot, I think I'm out of room. So I've been 
considering I got the new um, bins from North Dakota Modding thanks to uh, simulations. Actually, Taz, I think. So this is the farm. Let me speed up our. So this is the farm. This is the cow pasture. Um, I don't remember what this will hold, to be honest. And then we have the we have the uh, calf barn and the steer barn. And we got a bale storage, the freestall barn with the additional freestall barn. And then uh, machine shed, legacies machine shed. And then these I just color swapped. They were white. No, I made them red. And then... Hey, DJ, how's it going? Then I redone the fields because, well, you guys know me. I like square, square fields. So as you can see... I made them more long and square, just easier with course play and workers, so um, I made these fields a little bit smaller. I considered making this field different, and then I squared these up, and then I own this field in here, but I think what will happen is I'll buy this big wraparound, and then I'll just make some more square fields, and then I'll, you can tell when I was messing with my Alice 8000 I kept reloading it and it would the guy planting would get all wonky but yeah I figured I'll take auto drive and make myself a course so then the wagons can go to town on their own and I could just run the combine hello there is a reason why I can't get in what you be streams I don't have that many videos mighty dear farmer how are you doing Taz hey there Jeremiah hey Fenton farmer so yeah, we, I think, I think these wagons are, oh, they're empty. Okay, yeah, I just came back from the mill. That's right. So this is BSL's tractor, and then I went ahead and put a transmission in it. The version I had, it didn't have a transmission, and I really wanted to use this. I gotta reload my thing quick. It's not, there we go. Uh, yeah, I think there's only, t there might only be two or three videos, Mighty Deer. Everything else is live streams. I don't, I've only made a few videos. It's a lot more time consuming. I might rather put them in the buildings. Uh, Sim Station and, uh, Fairview, if you guys are still here, I'll go show you this some of the additions I made to this barn so I was showing this off earlier I put the windows in and I haven't animated them but they will be animated and then I made these light switches for the lights kick them on and then the lights over there will turn on so if we kick them off you can see the lights but yeah so I I kind of labeled stuff hopefully maybe it'll be easier to I'm a decent map when I get my PC. Hey, Doug. Uh, yeah, I haven't played uh, that map. No Creek. I have not played that map yet. Not saying I wouldn't play that map. It's just, oops, we forgot, our, forgot our wheat. Um, I don't know. I've been just having fun on this map, so I haven't really switched. We'll let that guy go, because well, he can go on his own. Also, something I do notice is we got weeds really bad. So we may end up... Uh, we may end up getting our, renting ourselves a sprayer. Because I don't have a sprayer. We're going to need a high boy sprayer anyways. So the combine should unload on his own, but we'll kind of keep an eye on him. Let's we'll pull these down here out of the way. Tab through. Get this guy going on round bailing. I think he's got to be offset by like three or something like that, because the gleaner's offset. I believe it's three.
Yeah, there you go. He's over the top of it. I like it. Looks, yeah, thanks, uh, Sim. Have you released the version of... No, I haven't. I haven't. I don't know that I've really done much more than that to it, though. So I'm really curious if it's... So uh, we need to get the Mighty D21. We need to be getting this hay going, too. Need to finish mow these corners out real quick. Link to what? Hey there, Ronnie Gold. How are you guys? Everybody's popping in here. Hopefully, everybody's liking the little cow, the little small open shed. I should have named it something else like open cow shed or small cow shed or. I don't even know where I got small open shed. But yeah, I've been working on the steer barn or feedlot barn. I've been think considering calling it the uh, feedlot barn or something. I know it doesn't, my first barn doesn't have any milk or slurry triggers, but you know, that's kind of the way I set it up. So you can, uh, just put your young ones in there. So yeah, we'll finish up this mowing real quick. Hey there, deer. Deer, three, three, two. Uh, did I? That's all right. It doesn't have to be 100%. I keep wanting to play closer and I always seem to zoom out. Let's bring that in to about 30. I was considering getting a disc bind, but instead I've been using this old one. This is by Scooter's Workbench. But yeah, I don't know. I think the, the old feedlot barn or the steer barn, I like to call it, a I think I'm pretty pretty close to get got to get the doors in or windows animated, and I think it'll be ready. Do like the worst thing is you can't color select everything. It's gonna have to be just the walls again. Hey there, James. How are you? If giants would let it use Thundars, but then console couldn't use it. But the Thundar placeable mo or color mod is pretty sweet. That's why I like to use. Hey, thanks, James. Yeah. Pretty awesome. Plan to make some more. I've been considering putting down the uh, granary I made on this farm I had on Mercer County. I don't have any grain store. But I, again, I was thinking about using those North Dakota modding's uh, new bins. Do and you end up watching uh, John McKinley last night all the way through? Did he end up uh, put my barn down or not? Oh shoot, I got fast running on. Hey hey, love the new barn. Well, thanks, Levi. I'm doing good. Just got off work. Headed home. From... Oh gosh, don't get in the wheat. Oh. All right, let's head down here. We're going to have a bunch of bales in this field. It actually looks kind of cool with all the bales out here. So come down here, get this guy unloaded. I had the big grain hopper on this thing, and then I took it off because I didn't have the fill plane right on it. Oh, God. Might have to circle around. I guess we could hit the back wagon, couldn't we? We got that 30 foot header just taking 30 foot in as much as she can. 
Hey, Kaler Farms, how are you? Oh, did he? Okay, yeah, no big deal. I was kind of curious. He's all about backing out, and I was like, you ain't got to do that. I mean, so far, this guy. I thought he would unload on the headlands, but maybe I didn't have the wagons in the field. Or maybe I shut that off. Let's just check real quick. Just lurking. Well, glad to have you lurking. Um, let's see. Am I in the combine? Yeah. Um, usually, which one is, is it? No, it's this one. Activated. Yeah. He, he should. I don't know why. Okay, we gotta get this guy tedding. Yeah, we need to get this field tedded. It's not a nice mode field right there. Looks good. I like making my hay field square. Just they mow nicer. I did start tinkering with this thing again, and that that eight thousand series. I think I might start all the way over with the eight thousand. I'm not sure. Do you still have a barn with giants that have the feet? Bunk outside, yeah, this barn right here. Um, this barn's still with giants, but it doesn't have this addition. It just has this barn, and then it has this feed bunk. Um, all the free stalls, uh, the milking parlor, the milk room. Yeah, that's with giants. Yeah. Like I said, maybe uh, with the, I guess people that haven't just got here, but they want me to take the cows out of the parlor. They don't want the cows in the parlor, but I do, so we'll see. I guess we'll put this, we'll put this big tractor on the tatter. Hey Marty, how are you doing? How's everybody doing tonight on Thursday night? Kind of crappy here. And we're unfolding this. Kind of a sweet little tether how it unfolds there. So yeah, I like to make my field square so I can just hire a worker just straight out. I don't have to do the whole course play. I can just go... Ah, no, this thing won't work that way, will it? I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll just go ahead and send them right down the... Uh, We'll just send him right down the mower path. Oh, stop it. You're that close. It should do just fine, I would think. Right? I would, I would think so. Yeah, I agree, James. I agree. I'm using the little, uh... Let's stop this guy. Let's dump him while we're here. Uh, I'm using the claws, uh... Round baler. I, I kind of thought about getting a new haul and round baler, but I wasn't sure if there's a new haul and round... Good new haul and round baler out there. Look at all them bales. Woo, we got a lot of bales. Probably should make some little square bales. Oh, I got a oats field too. I forgot. Oh man, Is that ready to go? No, we got oats right here, right? Oats. Where is oats? Yeah, oats. Yep, this is oats field. So we'll have that too at some point. Let's get this guy all back and going. There we go. That guy's bailing. That guy's getting eaten by the cows. And he's tedding. I just can't tell if that's going to work out good. Oh, thanks, Money. 
That's a good map for a little small open shed. Pull this guy ahead so he's out of the way. Let's jump in at 8,000. So I've been messing with the... Uh, well, I did redid the exhaust on it. It actually has a better exhaust on it. And then I've been working on the tires and how they were being crazy. It's still kind of doing it, so I'm going to have to probably... Hey, what's up, Rob? Yeah, I did see that. Well, I think it was an N5, wasn't it? That's pretty cool. I need to make... I have... At one point, I had the uh, decal for the N5 uh, on on that gleaner. I need to get it back on there. So, yeah, this wagon's pretty sweet. By Reese, you can just... Uh, Set the commands here. You think you put it like this. Put her down on the ground. Like Rooster makes everything just awesome. Boom. And in the barn they are. Then you just hit reset. And I think we're good to go. I think we might hook the little baler up for some hay. Um simulation uh there are they're already out the or the the little calf sheds already out this this big one's still uh pending testing with giants it's been yeah i'll probably be on for a while kyle uh it's been oh somebody's working on that gleaner are they yeah i've never really seen the n series that much in my life i've seen f series I never really seen the end series. All right, do I start picking up bales or do I leave them out here? Cause it looks awesome. I think we'll big, we'll round bale this field. And then I think we will little square bale that field of oats. I guess we might as well just start picking up bales. Got everything else running real nice, I think. That's running. The baler's running. Little that baler. I keep thinking about putting like the twine tie on, add on in. Maybe you gotta toggle it? No, it should work. I think he said he's made it so like it's, these wagons will take like the Heston bales and every. I mean, they'll take any bale you can want. Which, you know, Rooster, he does a heck of a job. Yeah, you don't. You do. I mean, I think there are starting to get to be more and more gleaners out there. But you're right. I mean, it's not not prominent at all. There he goes, see? Now he'll go and load down on them wagons over there. All on his own. Just driving around out here picking up some bale. Oh, I didn't pick him up right. Oh, there it goes. I wonder why I did that. Oh, we got a we got a collision. We better go help out. He don't know. Must have Frosty here driving. Okay, there we go. We'll help him out. Oh, there's a lot of kids. Oh, is there? There is a. Hmm. Maybe p post them, I guess. Yeah, I don't have Facebook, so I can't see Facebook mods. Thunder, no, what's his new mod? I didn't see what Thunder is working on. We're going to have to put a, the bigger hopper topper on this thing. Uh, let's see. All right, sounds good, James. Thanks.
What's going on? Yeah, what's up? Blowing the smoke. We're out here just doing all kinds of business. He is going to be out here for a while. But, I mean, it's the D21, so. Yeah, it was because I was trying to put the hopper topper on the gleaner, but I don't, I, I never saved it. I think I wanted to redo it. Some people seen it. I put a picture one time of having a bigger hop topper on this. She's a pretty sweet ride. She looks a lot better than she ever did. Look at him going over there. He's just tearing it up. I want you guys to turn this to like 70 or something, don't you? He is calling Harvest Master. Claws Baylor. Yeah, we got the Claws Baylor. I need a new haul on or something. Alright, let's get back to. Well, how full is he? That round baler is just going to catch up to him real quick, like. Real quick, like he's probably got what two passes here, and he should be done. We got some manure to haul. I don't have a manure spreader, but I've, I don't think I've really cheated any money. Let's see, did I cheat anything in? I don't think so. I think I've been pretty straightforward. We're going to have two more loads of wheat that got to go to town. Which is going to be good. Am I still playing with it? Like, let's just... I always zoom out so far is my problem. Oh, his new mod's called Harvest Man. Oh, I got you. What's it supposed to be for? I would do it myself, but then the bailer won't pick it up, right? That becomes the problem. Alright, let's pick up some more bales. If I knew you needed someone to run, why? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't send you this, though. I guess I could take this trailer out, but... Yeah, this thing works sweet. I mean, I, I couldn't find goosenecks that would pick these up. But Rooster got her. He got them to pick these up. Yeah, see, there I am again, always zoomed out. If I had you running wagons, I would just get too much done. So, yeah, I did find that I had... The back hitch always had problems with this tractor. And I did find that, uh, so this is the old one. With no dash. And this is this one. But I found that my front tires weren't placed right. They were way up in there. They still could be worked on. Um, there's like a big, there's like a 42. 18 442s on the back, which makes her sit a lot higher. But the gleaner would look sick. You have the gleaner. If the rain doesn't let up, the racing season is basically <laughs> over. Well, you might be done. I was gonna. Harvest to a different fill type. 
Harvest to a different fill type depending on the growth state the crop is in. Middle harvest state. Try. Hey, Matt Jones. How are you? Yeah, Kyle. So you're saying it affects basically affects your uh huh? So you basically gotta wait till your crop says it's ready. I mean that'd be awesome. I don't know. Like it'll tell you percentage of moisture, and if you're over the certain percentage of moisture, then you get white crop. I don't know. Yeah, maybe something like that. There we go. I uh, love it. Oh, I'm doing real good. Hopefully you went and downloaded that new barn. We'll just take a stroll through the barns here. I got this nice tight barnyard. Look at that. We still sneak through there. Right there, this barn right here, guys. She's, she's on the mod hub. Get yourself a little calf barn. Yep. See, those mods scare me, though. If it's got a lot... See, I don't really play with a lot of scripted mods. I don't... I like Cores Play and Auto Driver. The only two scripted mods I have on this. I just... I don't play with a lot of scripted mods. He's even unloading on it? What a guy. How empty. Oh, he's still got some in him. All right, let's uh, let's head him back up to the barnyard. I might as well cut this little jag. I guess it's gonna drive me nuts otherwise. Oh, yep, that's that. Uh, I need to fix that on this thing. I know what that is. I made it so I was trying to make it so this window would fold and unfold whenever you wanted it to, but instead. It folds whenever you finish course play and then it won't let you do anything again. I know how to fix it, I just haven't fixed it. I need to make the windows something else, that's what I need to do. So we'll go ahead and put our nice header down. I can't even believe we, I still built this, this looks nice. Nice, nice header. She's a beaut. Okay, let's go grab these wagons. What do you guys think? Going around the town? Baylor should be about done. We'll take this big egg, Co. You'd be surprised. This thing's actually pretty nice inside. Uh, yeah. For anybody that gives BSL a hard time, he... He's got a pretty good little setup right here. Let's zoom out a little bit. 75 can be too much? Yeah. Maybe too much. So let's go 70. There we go. That don't look too bad. We got our four ways on. I know the way to town. Oh, that's it in game or um, in mod hub fail storage. Um, gosh, I, I don't know who made them. I just was looked up bail storage, and that's what I wanted a red one for this farm, obviously. So, yep, let's take her. We're heading to town. Need to buy this little patch too here. Trying to complete my farm. Yeah, I put a I put a transmission in. This thing runs a lot better with the transmission. But it was going like 34 miles an hour. Now I only got it going 34 or 24. I should I should uh, bump that up a little bit. When do you think the next F? I don't know. I hope next FS don't come out for two more years. What's up, FS22? It's official. Farm Sim 22, FS22. But yeah, I don't know how far we'll end up expanding the farm, but I don't know. I kind of wish there was some uh, traffic on these roads. Maybe some light traffic, but. I mean, I can pretty much do whatever I want here. But yeah, we're gonna we're built we're built here where the 
uh, starter farm is, but we got room. We could expand. Uh, maybe we gotta buy another combine or something, but we we could definitely get some more acreage. I'm doing good. Real nice. These both. I think these wagons tarp too, don't they? Yeah, there we go. Don't want our wheat blowing out. I might as well tarp them up. The only thing I don't like is the rims like instantly get dirty. They get dirty really quick. But yeah, overall, this is a nice tractor. Yeah, once we get into town, the traffic gets a little more crazy. Neighbors cows out there, look at them, them look nice. I see where DJ, he did a, he's doing a playthrough on this. He sold those cows. He's worried they were going to die. I ain't touched them. They're still alive. Yeah, we're coming into big town of Alma. Do I have my lights on? Yeah, I do. We're going to throw some fire stones. Oh, them fire stones, yeah. Oh. Yeah, this map is so awesome. Let's go back in the cab here a little bit. Oh, yeah, this is just, We better slow down. Traffic's gonna get a little crazy. There's Bob. What's up? Oh, look at this. It just looks like... Yep, there's an abandoned house. There he is. There's Bill. Give him the horn. I mean, he took the time and he made it awesome. We could pull over here and get ourselves some dinner maybe if we need to. Stop at the garage. No, I think I always... Oh, I think I needed to turn there. Shoot. Oh, I never noticed there was noises there. Well, we can turn here though. It'll be alright. I don't know that there's necessarily like a point to get like green sample. Oh, there is. There's like a little uh, thing. It would be sweet if I was a probe. Yep. I'm gonna go ahead there. Oh, does it have the scale work? I wonder. Oh, it does work. Well, that's awesome. Got 17. What if we back tractor up? Get a little more weight. Oh, our weight's gonna go off because of the back. Let's see if it's moved. Oh yeah, that's nice. That ah, live scale. All right. Well, we need to figure out what we weigh empty then. How are you, Rush Berry? Now I don't know if you can dump here. I always dump in the other one. Let's see if we can dump here. Is this a dump point? Oh, it is. Okay. Yeah, let's just dump here. Oh, the tarp comes off. That's cool. Now, the other one, you can dump both the wagons at the same time. Is this pit big enough? Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's freaking... That's awesome. I don't know why the grain's not coming out, but that's okay. Just stand here talking to him. Yep, yeah, what's up? Yep. Yeah. Looks like you're about out of propane. Corn dryer. Uh, oops, sorry, I needed to catch up. Honestly, I don't think they could get any more realistic. Yeah, I know, 22 has been pretty awesome. That's why I'm, I don't really care for a new one. This is fine with me. Yeah, well, glad to have you, Rush Perry. I think this is the one you have to sell at the... Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, I don't want to sell it at the train. That's why my money's not going up. Well, how do I do that? Oh, God. I messed it all up. I gotta go here? Where do I rent the train at? it! See when I start something new? I go back to this building? To... Where do I rent the train? Uh, okay, so... Yeah, there's a train. Rent train. Yeah, okay. You were at it. Okay, okay. 
Do I gotta wait on the train? I've never used the train before. Am I on the wrong side, maybe? I gotta call the train or something? Right here, maybe? I'm not seeing any prompts up there in the left-hand corner. I've never once used the train, so... Do I gotta open this door? No, no, no. Oh, there we go. What was that? Hmm. Oh, rent train. Train is going to arrive. Okay. I guess let's do this. I've never done this before. Have you guys done this? Let's pull my tractor out. Let's not be unpolite here, you know. Maybe somebody else wants to not rent the train and unload. Let's pull around back here quick. Yeah, I didn't know there was a I didn't know how to rent a train. I never even used it like on Elm Creek. Let's slow my running down a little bit. Since we're waiting on the train. Let's just... Let's just check our phone here. Is the train coming from that way? Uh, what I was wanting to check is make sure we're... Okay, yep, that guy's still going. He's actually moving along pretty decent on it, I'm not gonna lie. So what does it say? Does it tell me when the train's gonna be here. Return rented train. Well, I need the train, right? I guess it takes a while, or no? Who in chat there is ever who's who's ever used the train? He's probably going around the outside of the map right now. I bet. If you go up, you usually can see. So the train tracks go there. It's so sweet how they have such a good border. That's what makes and breaks me on a map. Yeah, I don't see no train. I gotta call him on the celly? Give him a phone call? Oh shoot, we're up here. What's going on? Just checking that grain leg, making sure everything's alright. Oh, no collisions, boo. I want to be able to walk up on top of these bins. It's a pretty sweet setup, though. <laughs> yeah, you're learning from me. Don't learn from me. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm guessing it comes. Do I gotta? Do I have to do something more? No one. No, I guess no one's probably used the train. Oh, what's this say? Something said yes or no. I've seen it, but I don't know where I was at. Alright, let's pull the old F5. Oh, no, F5 don't show me. There's a trigger right there. Shows, oh, shows debugs. Yeah, I don't need that. I don't think it's coming. Oh, was that the problem? I think somebody did say that. I never. So we lost our money. I guess here. You know what? We can. You know what? I figured it out. I don't know. Does it store our grain in the? Even if it does, we can't sell it. I never updated my. Where's it show we got stored? Yeah, I got thirteen. Yeah. Oh well. What we'll do? We'll just fill our wagons and go dump them over at the other one. I don't know why I didn't think of that earlier. I thought the train would actually come. Yep, so uh, I think you update the map and it would work. And maybe I'll have to do that as update the map. And then it would work. I just, I didn't. And that's my fault. Number one, I didn't know where I was dumping. And then two, yeah, I... I don't know trains. I mean, yeah, Sim, I mean, I kind of wish you would have played on this map, but No Creek is definitely the map I know you want to be playing on. It's sick, Bert, but did you update your map? I haven't. I haven't updated my map. Rank, you used the, you used the uh, train one time? Yeah. Did you, did you have the updated map, though? 
I'd assume if, you, if I would update, probably it would work. And I also said that the alfalfa wouldn't make in the hay. I could make it in the little bales. I don't know if anyone else had that with the old version. Um, that was the other thing I had problems with. So if you guys have, uh, that are playing on this map, where, where do you guys make your farm? Did you go with the starting farm like I did? Oh, on Elm Creek, yeah. See, I never used it on Elm Creek either. I, I usually sold in that middle bottom one. That's usually where I sold. It was just convenient and close. I had auto drive set up. You need to s I, I need to make an auto drive course to here. So when we get to harvesting the corn and the beans, we got 218,207. Oh yeah, we're making in the money. Okay, let's uh, pull out here. Hopefully we... There he is. There's the mayor. How's it going, Roger? He's probably going to the pub. Oh, he's probably getting some breadsticks. There you go, yeah. We're on the wrong side of the road. We're just trying not to hit uh, anybody's car here. Sorry about that. Coming through. Oh, he beat back at me. Sorry. Yeah, did they fix those, James? Do you know? I, I think they fixed them. Or they're working on an update, I know. He's swerving out of the way. Did you see that? He was like, I gotta get out of the way. <laughs> You'd rather play Alma? Alma's pretty... I, you know what? The row crop stuff seems cool. I mean, it, it, it does. But I don't really... I don't really care that much. Like, most times I just hire mine done. I just... I want to be doing like the logistic stuff like keeping six things running that's how I can farm with little equipment but get a lot done because like I just set things up and then hit hire a worker if I were you know what if I were Fairview Farms I would be taking a screenshot right about now let's get one there we go. This is a nice one, yeah? Oh, that's, that's beautiful wagons. I love the Patriot. I kept thinking about taking the stars and the stripes like this and putting it on the Gleaner. I think it looks sweet. I think it look look real cool. Have it like bleeding through the galvanized. Oh yeah, that'd look nice. Did I shut my tractor off? Yeah, I hit the... I accidentally stalled it. <laughs> I just... I was just getting ready to ask you how you... Yeah, I haven't played the single one yet, Rank. Uh, it came out and I've been playing this map and I've been trying to get barns done for everybody. It's kind of a high, kind of, when you get the barn on the mod hub. It's kind of like you're watching, seeing how things are going, seeing if people like it. I kind of was like lurking around uh, YouTube's last night, just kind of seeing what kind of people were using it and stuff. <laughs> it's just I like seeing people use stuff that I made. It's kind of cool. Uh, this is BSL's Rob. Uh, it's on his Patreon, or I think so, or maybe it's a. Po I'm not sure. But yeah, this is BSL's tractor. But yeah, it's 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 a really good model. I mean, it's got American Hitch on the back of it and stuff. I mean, he did a, an excellent job on it. The cab's real nice. The only thing is, I noticed the decal needs a little bit of work. I thought about messing with it, but I haven't gotten to it yet. There we go. Don't need them turn signal or the flashers no more. What else do you guys want to get into? Haul some manure. I ain't got a manure spreader. We could buy one though. Put that on 8,000, you guys think? What do you think? Uh, I think the road cop stuff is interesting. See, I personally tried to play it really. So the road cop stuff will help with that. Also, congrats on the barn. Thanks, THG. Yeah, that's why I assumed he probably fixed the... 
Let's just pull these around back. The side of the shed here is just kind of a catch-22 wherever we need stuff to we're using or need to be parked we just park it okay what was I wanting to do also manure we can probably get something raking too oh yeah he's about done there he is about done there hey Tony how you doing buddy haul some manure okay we can haul some manure I need to buy a manure spreader. So I got... Oh, I need to spray this corn, too. Probably need to spray everything. Yeah, Levi, we'll get back in there real quick here. Let's check our weeds. Which one's weeds under? Is weeds under this one? Yeah, weeds. Oh, it doesn't say I have... Oh, that's right. That's the grass. He... Oh, yeah, okay. It looks like weeds to me. I would have been spraying that. Lincoln Creek over to 22. Oh, okay, I never played that map. I'm kind of a rookie to maps. I don't really. Okay, so we got options. Um, Kyle's favorite. If Kyle's still in here, Kyle, you still in here? Hey, Scott, Scott's in here. How you doing, Scott Olson? I got this manure spreader, which is a slick one. I wouldn't mind using it. Uh, I got this one. Uh, we could use that one. What other manure spreaders I got? I think that's about it. I was going to use this as my skid loader, but it's a little wonky. I don't have a lot of mods in here. I thought about using this baler. I thought about it. I don't know. Um, I also, oh, I wanted to use this. Oh, where's it at? I wanted to use this chopper really bad, but... The head like wouldn't pick up right, and then it would uh, it would just do weird things. So I didn't use it. I also thought about using this. I don't have my own chopper yet. Anyways, I downloaded this. I had to try it out. In the Kinsey's Planner Row Company, um, uh, JM JMF has asked me about it a little bit if I wanted to, but. Uh, to be honest with you, I mean, I have them in here. They need, I need, I mean, if I was going to do anything, I would just completely start over. So I guess side slinger or box spreader. Okay, no one said anything. Um, I guess let's just go with the standard. What's the box spreader? 19.5. 54,000. Woo. What's this hold? It'll hold... Perfect, 9.8 meters cubed. And this will hold 16 meters cubed. That other one only holds 9? Oh, well, we might as well go with the big one then, huh? Smaller ones. Yeah, let's just get this one. That seems to fit this farm a little good. A little bit better. We got this tractor still running? Nope, I turned it off. I'm terrible because I don't usually use... Uh, Ooh, let's see if this tractor... It does not like the whole um, liquid tankers. I don't know why. I think I tried it with the old ones and it doesn't do it. The old tractor, that is. You alright, grumpy gray farmer? Yeah, I'm good. You got the gale from BSL? The gale... Oh, the, like side slinger? No, I mean I, I mean I could, but I don't have it. No. Ooh, do I have my marker set up to automatically load some poop? I wonder. Not sure. Might have to load it old school style. I gotta think of this setup right here, classic. Yeah. Huh? Well, that's almost worth the screenshot right there. See, the hitch could be a little bit higher. But I feel like the spreader's hitch could be a little bit higher. Oh, quick. We got to get the D21. It looks like it's done. Nope, not done. Said someone fin... Oh, it's the round baler's finished. What what rig do I got? Um, oh, it's in this shed. I need a bigger rake because I just have this. I have this rake. 
guess we could rake by hand. Um, let's do this. We gotta, we gotta keep the hay and business going. For sure. Otherwise, that job's just not gonna get done. So let's grab the, let's grab this little egg co. Got a nice wooden gate there. Just swing that out of the way. Look at the cows. Oh my god, cow. Hey, get out of there, Bessie. You're not made for the mixer. Oop. This is JMF's little tractor. It's nice for my tight barnyard here. Gets around real nice. Okay, we don't want we don't want the cows out, so let's go ahead. Shut that. I don't know why it won't let me enter this thing. That's why I got a tab. That's why I got the tab. Alright, let's unhook the... Let's unhook the mixer right back here so it's out of the way. We'll hook this guy to the rake. He's got some speed, don't he? 27 miles an hour? Oh yeah. Okay, let's uh, hit the wall. Yep, we got that done. Back up and get hooked up to this nice rake. Get him unfolded. We got to put our arm down. There we go. Got that down, I think, you know. There we go, put that down. I also don't know where this came from. I think it's an in-game mod hub, to be honest with you. Um, we're just going to let this guy go back and forth and do his own thing. Because we're going to be bailing by... Oh, man. What do we want to do here? We're going to have to make these all in little square bales. Hmm. Ah, uh, Levi. Yes. They've sent it back to me. They want me to take the cows out of the inside, but I'm trying to trying to get it so that it will have the cows in it yet. They won't, don't want the cows in the parlor, I should say. Is what I'm is what I'm trying to say. Well, that's gonna be a tight squeeze to get back into there. To... Oh, that's gonna be a tight squeeze. I gotta come in a little more square. Guess we'll try hauling out this manure first. Oh yeah. Which one are we pulling out of? Oh right here. Perfect. I got that set up real nice. Yeah. It's doing it. Um but yeah, this isn't the version that they have though, with the additional but I did figure out how to make these look nicer. Well, they could still look a little bit better. Some of them look real nice. Some of them look more boxy. But yeah, uh, we don't. I haven't put no straw in here in a while. And they make too much poop. I also have the uh, automatic milk trigger. I don't want to sell my milk personally, so. You guys want to see me load some or not? Hey, hounds. How are you? Yeah, I need to put straw in. Ain't nothing, nothing's making manure because I haven't put any straw in. So I do believe this barn has automatic loading too. Yeah, there we go. I seen a guy testing it or playing with it. Look at the calves. The one's laying on the manure. He's like, yeah, I'm just chilling. No, he's just floating. Look at him. Yep. He's like, I'm gonna crawl up in that nice feed bunk. What do you guys think of that feed bunk, huh? Real nice. Yeah, Scott. Yeah, the this one's gonna. I'm shooting for all platforms. If we could get till nighttime, I, maybe you guys haven't seen it, and I don't know why I place it. Sometimes it places down perfect, and sometimes it does that, which drives me nuts. Because I have it all triggered out perfect. Um, but yeah, if we go to six o'clock at night, there would be cows that show up. So. 
stick around. We'll uh, we'll fast forward time once we get some hay baled. Get this manure hauled. We got a little bit more room. Let's back up to the heifer barn or the steer barn there. I know I I'm pretty sure I have automatic loading back here too. Just get all this manure. What do you guys think of this tight barnyard? It's a little bit tricky, but I feel like it's pretty realistic. There we go. There we go. We're loading that manure. So we'll get this hauled. Then we'll hop in the skid loader. I think we'll grab some bales. We'll bed the. Uh, we'll bed all the cows. Okay. We got baling. We got all kinds of stuff to do. See how it's like in the shake? I don't know why it's doing that. I don't know if it's something to do with the tires part of it. I can't figure it out. I'm, I've looked at a million things trying to figure it out. Hey, Tristan, how are you? You've been pumping out the videos lately. I don't always comment, but I do tend to watch. Oh, I tell you what, we should be saving this for our hayfield. That's where we should be putting this. Yeah, why don't we hook the baler up? What what tractor? What do we all got left tractor wise? We got the big egg co. That's gonna be too big. Guess we could just put this tractor on the baler. How you liking making all the videos, Tristan? You're doing a heck of a job. Real nice job. Hopefully you went and got that new uh, calf barn for your small uh, farm build, small American farm build. So this is a mod, no, this baler is, it's something I should release for you console guys. So uh, you can make the little bales. You got rooster's wagon, but what you need is a baler. Because Giants didn't think you'd need a hitch on here, I guess. So I made it so it does have a hitch. We'll swing around down here at the bottom of the... I did put a little shed down here. I guess I didn't show that. Yeah, you've been doing a real nice job, Tristan. Keep it up. You make some epic thumbnails. I wish I could make thumbnails half as good as what you you and a bunch of other guys do. Yeah, put this little wooden shed down here. We got this nice little... I squared this field up a little bit. Oh, you never know, Scott. You never know. I'm guessing you're console then, Scott, huh? Operating mode. What do you, I mean, what do you use for a baler, Scott? If you're doing some little square bales on console, what are you using? Something German or something different? Are you baling these on the ground and picking them up? Look at them bales just pumping out of there. Ooh, we do have an auto steer on here. Nice auto steer. See ya. Hey, see you later. You use the Vermeer. So you use the round baler. Uh, cause I was, I mean, like, if you want to make little square bales, do you make little square bales at all or not? Hey, Kyler, thanks for, uh, thanks for using it. Thanks for downloading it. Let's just look quick, I'll look quick, see what kind of downloads we're up to. Um, we're up to about 10,500. Oh, that's pretty cool.
Hey, Ethan. Yeah, Hounds, that's what I was kind of talking to Rooster about. I'm like, we really need to... Like, maybe I should just send this. So you guys can have some. I mean, I know I know some people probably going to want John Deere Baylor, New Holland Baylor, but... I mean, this would work out fine. I wouldn't have to do much. Just send it in with the hitch. I can't believe no one's done that. I mean... That's so easy. And maybe somebody else will because I don't, I mean, I don't want to. I just, I know you guys need something. Maybe I should, maybe I should just do it. Let's scooch him over a little bit. I just can't believe some, I mean like, even like the uh, enhanced animals. I just can't believe the consoles don't have enhanced animals. Yeah, do you guys use this baler at all or not? For yeah, Ethan, did you did you go download it? Did you guys download it? Did you rate it? Give it a give it a five star. We're running uh, a five star average, so it's, thank you so much to you guys. that have I appreciate it. I don't know if it helps me with giants or not. I'm no, new to the whole thing. Yeah, I want to uh, each baler. We used to have a what? I think a seven fifteen? No, four fifteen, four forty. I think it was an IH four forty years ago. A baler. Uh, Ethan, uh, this is Alma, but no, the cow barn and the steer barn aren't yet. Uh. The steer barn I haven't finished. I need to get the windows uh, automated. Maybe we'll get... I need to... I wanted to ask... I think I'm going to make the windows automate all on one trigger, but they're going to, like, one at a time. Hey, Kobe. Um, hounds, but with uh, bale storage, I would think it, it wouldn't matter, would it? I mean, because that's the reason I put the bale storage in, well, and because it's realistic to have the little bales up in the hayloft, but, uh, if you put them inside of a shed, doesn't your bale count go down, or no? I mean, I don't, I don't play consoles, so I'm not really sure. Oh, that's not what I want. Yeah, I was I was thinking if you put them inside of the object storage, it, it takes it back there. You gave it a negative five stars. What? Yeah, am I am I right, sick bird? If you if you put them in the storage, your it, it takes them like off your bail count, I think. The eighty ten well, not too big, I guess, for the bailer. You need a little bit of power on that thing. And this would only be about, what, 110 horse or so? Jeez. It's definitely helpful towards that, but I don't... Uh, really pick them up. Full from supper there, Ronnie. What would we have? Alright, what would we have for supper? We got a little rake just going. He's getting her done. Yep. Let's hop inside of here. There's the full gauges everybody's wanting to see. I'm sure. I think we're turning. Oh boy. Wait a minute. Okay, we're going to have to do this out of cab quick. We'll hop back in in one minute. Hopefully we got enough room to get down and back quick. Or I mean one more time. But yeah, we got the GPS monitor. Got the nice cloth. The nice Alice Chalmers on the floor. But yeah, I need to model like radio and all that kind of stuff for the top. But yeah, it's definitely a lot better than what it was. Stir fry with, oh man, I haven't had stir fry in a long time. Or no, shake, I'm thinking shake and bake, that's what I'm thinking. Let's go back in a little bit. 
There we go. Yeah, it's got all the, if you turn the light switches, they all work. But I need to get the lever. Levers don't work. Yeah, this bale trailer roosters. I'm telling you what, that's he did a nice job on it. No surprise though. Well, we're picking this field up fast. I'm surprised. I, th I thought this would take a while doing it by hand, but it don't seem like it. I mean, yeah, it would be nice if you guys could, you know, pick up these. Other. And I talked to him about it. He was, because he released a John Deere baler for a comp PC. And he said he wants to build one for, you know, console, but he, he would have to redo it all. He, or he would want to redo it all. And I know he's been working on that big bale trailer. And then he, I think he wants to, actually, I don't know what he's going to work on next. But yeah, he's doing, I mean, he does a heck of a job. Really nice work and he's super helpful we've had some taco salad tonight taco salad okay not much of a salad kind of guy but maybe a taco salad let's hop out and get this d21 out of the way this big daddy look at him We'll get him on the other side. Yeah, the new John Deere Ripper, that thing is sweet. He let me test that too. And I'll tell you what, uh, the springs moving on the front, now that's, that's next level. That is next level. I got my nice filters on here with the, the battery decal. I mean, this... Uh, this ain't a bad model. I know you were, Ethan. I was giving you a hard time. Ten thousand five hundred downloads. That's just—I mean—that's crazy. I think the big cow barn is just—I think a lot more people will like it. It's—I got to get giants to get out of their little bubble and realize, you know. I think you guys want something like that. Oh man, we about got a full wagon. Mr. Farqua, how are you? It's, it's got to be real late for you. I really appreciate you watching. I did touch, I did start doing more things to it, Mr. Farqua. Yes, look at that. You're still in here too. Uh, I want to ask you. Some. Oh shoot, we're full. Oh dang gum, we're full, full. Eee. All right, let's. Uh, oh no, wait. We got to hook back to the baler. Unhook that. Let's unhook that. Need to hook to this wagon. Oh, we got bales everywhere. We got a mess. Yeah, we should be able to get in there. DO24? I don't know what that is. DO24. Mr. Farqua, have you seen the uh, new cow sheds? Little sheds I made. Or have you seen any of them, I guess. Uh, what barn do I want to put this in? I guess I'll put these in for the... We'll put this in the heifer barn. <laughs> uh, the old three meter jokes. It's fine. I mean, it sucks for you guys, but... I wish the parlor would play, uh, and, and I think I found a way, so instead of this all being, so I need to make it more like this stuff, further out, and I could even make it so it's dirt or grass, 
so it doesn't do this, but come into the parlor here. Um, so it doesn't do this. It's all scissors and it's not leveling right when placed, but otherwise it looks sweet when it is placed right. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, that's the milk parlor or milk room. And then this is the. I was about to set Da Vinci to render overnight. Thought I'd pop. Ah, yeah, trying to put together a late night video. Yeah, if you guys never watched, so a few shout outs to people. Sim Station, I'm sure everybody in here has watched him. He does a heck of a job. Um, go watch him. And uh, Mr. Farqua too, he's on uh, the Twitch. And I think you do YouTube. No, you do YouTube. You don't do Twitch, maybe. But yeah, this is the Hayloft. Uh, but yeah, go watch Mr. Farqua. He, he does some really, really nice stuff. Watched a lot of his stuff. Let's just unload these into this shed. Um, some. Uh, I don't know why. I've placed that thing, this barn, I bet, oh my gosh, six million times. And it seems like it places fine, and it won't place fine. It seems like you can place it in the same spot twice. And sometimes it'll place right and it won't. It's just crazy. I don't know how else well is going to work. The trigger's there. I know it is. Uh, come on. So I was too far. I was a little too far. Yeah, some people said I need like an elevator. Which it would be cool, but... I mean, at least they go up in a hammer. So you have seen these, Mr. Parqua. F1, ooh. What'd you say, Ethan? I read it, now what'd you say? The Monteith, yeah, the Monteith is going away though, he's going to the note creek was it alma was it alma oh that's i don't want that i just want to open the door we'll go back up here and show you guys the bales because i made this one so it goes level by level the one on the mod hub is going to go up one because well i haven't wanted to switch it because <laughs> i'll be back in testing again so i just left it alone can I up? Ah, uh, stupid thing. Anywho. You're using two of my cattle. Are you saying you placed her down twice? That's awesome. Yeah, they kind of, you can get them pretty close together. So if you want to make it so you had like a longer shed. Oh yeah, I have this shed. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this. You've seen maybe pictures of it. So this is what I was going to place down for grain. Wait, oh, wrong thing. Uh, I guess I had it on Mercer County if you watch that. But this is a granary. I thought about really working on this. Uh, and submitting this to Giants. But I thought about putting some like steel tanks on the outside of it. That would hold grain. But yeah, this will hold 500,000 liters. I thought about placing this down like somewhere in here. Maybe back here or something. For grain. But sheds, so where's my abandoned steer bar? Okay, so yeah, this was a shed I built for um, Large H. But I this was a cattle barn. I Look, I made... Isn't this awesome? I made the nailing plates and everything. And the rafters. Um, it's got the... Uh, grooved concrete. It's got... Like an old wood. Uh, if we turn it a little bit, you can see. Like it's got a wood thing, and it's got like a dirt driveway on the back. It's a pretty sweet barn. It, it, I mean, it really was. Like, could you imagine this is your guys' cattle barn? Huh? 
You guys could put like, I don't know. It's a lot smaller than, this is only 300 foot, where Legacy is 600. So maybe you could put 400 in here. And build like a feed bunk. Feed bunk out front. Yeah, I built this like in one weekend I built this thing. I don't think I have it color selectable. No, I don't. But it could be. I mean, it's pretty simple on my end. But yeah, I think eh, he wants it like this for like putting equipment in. But yeah, that's another building I built. And these are all the ones you guys have seen. These are all off of uh, Midwest Rise, and I just redid them. You can never no. Too much cows? No, no such. I mean, they're not milk cows. They're beef cows. I need to make more milk cow stuff, but yeah, that would just be for beef cows. For the beef, beef. It's what's for dinner. Uh, did I miss anybody going to finish my teeth? Uh, using two of your kind of barns. Yeah, Alma's sweet. You never... Mr. Farquaad, if you're going to watch for a uh, do you... Have you been to town? Oh, I, I will go to town. You've probably seen videos of town. Town is slick. We should be home in order with the D21. Why are we not home in order with the D21? <laughs> I will I will run to town and show you. I know the D twenty one won't have that problem with it. Cause she's awesome. Look at this little bugger. Just a nice little setup there. <laughs> James. Uh change some of the building colors. How hard is it? Well, what do you want to do? You want to... Is it a metal barn? Is it a wood barn? Is it UDIM? Does it not? How many colors do you want? Trim? Doors? Roof? As that all takes... That's... You might as well start back over. At least from my experience. <laughs> hey, Waylon. Yeah, I can't get into logging. I don't. I mean, I've tried it, but I'm not into logging. I'm into farming. See, look at that though. Oh, the D21 squats with her too a little bit, don't she? I guess so. All right. Maybe we got to put the big egg co on her. Wood walls. Wood walls would mean you need to change the you yeah, probably change the texture oh we're just getting that manure just put right on there hauling that manure look at us Woo. flinging turds oh oh I'm not watching I was trying to read Let's just let this guy do it. Been learning logs. I'm shit at it for real. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I can't do the log stuff. Look at this setup. Just flinging the turds. Let's get a famous screenshot here. Kaplow. See, I, d I don't know if it's because I d just don't have... J I don't have joysticks and stuff. Like, I just play with a controller. So I just... I, I never liked it that much. You're up at field 14. Let's check out where field 14... Where's field 14 at? Uh, 17, 13, 11, 12. You'd think it'd be right here. We got 11, we got 12. All right there, 14. Oh, you're just right down the road. So you are right over. Let's check out where... 
Kyler's at. <laughs> How are you doing, Scooter, my buddy? Here is where Kyle's at. I think he said right field 14. Yep, right here. You taught me everything. You're the one that pushed me, Scooter. Here's the next thing I want to place down is uh, I want to put a this pig pen. This pig pen looks absolutely awesome. I don't none care for this kind of stuff. It doesn't really. But this, this is sweet. Oh, I would put a concrete lot out front, but. Yeah, I would like to. I don't know where you put, like, the food and stuff. Let's check that out quick. Oh, it won't show probably because I don't own it. Maybe I'll buy this farm. Did I miss it? Oh, it's on the other one. Wait a minute. Did it say I'll oh, switch between trains? Yeah, I, it's because I don't own it. Hmm. Oh well. That guy's still going. Oh, he's still flinging turds. Not sure how he got all the way over there. Yeah, uh, there's always something on the Amazon wish list, ain't there? We gotta get rid of this tractor. He's in the way. So I'm actually reworking a farm to put your barn in. First time you ever put in. So you put the little. Which one did you put in? Let me go show you guys. Okay, everybody's here. Let me. There's a lot of you here. Do Ann seen this like 16 times because I like showing it off. Uh, this is the one I just released. Oh, I said I was going to put straw in. I get so distracted. So here's the next. Well. One of the, I, you know, this one's with giants. So I put out of the windows. Uh, the doors work. Everything works. Of course it does. Um, it's got a nice past or a nice feed lot. Um, straw trigger. You put the bales in. But I added all this stuff. Huh? What do you guys think? Bale board. If we stop here. You can get the bales from the hayloft. So this is the hayloft. We got our bales up there. So if we come here. Open our thing. And we can get the bales out. So then the bales spawn over here. We can put our bales in the feed bunk. And then. These are the light switches. So if we look at them. This is like a fuse, fuse box. Blunk, and then the lights come on. Well, this is for the hayloft lights. So they just shine up. I ran the conduit and up to the lights, junction box and everything. So then were those lights, and then these are for the main barn lights. You can see over there the lights turning on and off. Yeah, I did see the move, move mods, move animal mods. That did look pretty cool. Yeah, I've seen it a lot. I was second here, but it's every time. Uh, so, one thing I wanted to ask. I don't think I've asked this yet. Or at least I don't think anyone's answered me. So, I'm going to make this all the window. These are going to be windows that open and shut. And I'm going to put the trigger and uh, everything on this board. It's going to look... I don't know what it's going to look like yet. But... Or does everybody want it so that you open each individual window? Or what I was thinking was there would be one spot. You open, it'll open all the windows. But it will like open one window, open two windows, open the third window. And then I'll just put it on this board. What, what would be best? Just one trigger location like here and it opens all the windows? I mean, do, do you guys... Are you worried about opening each window separately? You can't really see these windows that well, but... I kinda... They're not really windows, I guess. They're like... Mate, they're like louvers, basically. And I might make them actually extend out a little bit more. One switch, one trigger, one spot? Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Alright, that's what I'll do. That's what I was thinking today. Like these, you 
this open and it opens each individual uh, door like that and so it's same up there and everything but it's a little different scenario so yeah I, that's what I was thinking one trigger uh, I don't know what I want to put here like power or window or like window trigger a window I don't know does this look cheesy to you guys or do you think you like this like the bail board stop here like the lights and then it's labeled I mean, sometimes you look and you look and you look for stuff. I'm just trying to make it a little bit more easier. And I, I think the switch thing is just pretty sweet. You like the big labels? Okay. Yeah, I kind of, kind of just trying to make it, yeah, a little bit. I don't think this barn will be too hard to figure out. I don't know. I thought about putting like milk things out here for the milk trick because if you turn the triggers on, it's here. But then they told me to remove this trigger. And this trigger is for the bales. They're like, oh, do you have nothing that needs to be unloaded there? So I sent it back to Giants. And yeah, it's for the bales to go in the storage. Can I steal that switch? Hey, thanks, Row Crop. How you doing, buddy? Um, boop, 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 I, I can never move around that quick with the, oh yeah, guys, this is Scooter work, Scooter's workbench's uh, light on this building, he built it, I just placed it, so, I mean, I stole your light, okay, I, di I just thought people would think this looked cheesy, like, the way I made this look, I was kind of nervous about that, but. Uh, I don't know. I, I thought it was cool when I made it, but I was kind of worried. Do you like the windows idea? I, I wanted to put a curtain in. I just, I haven't made a curtain yet, and I heard they're kind of a nightmare, so I haven't really messed with it yet, but. Yeah, so each of the lights have their own, the conduits ran, and then it's got a little piece of flex liquid tight down to the light fixture. Yeah. Yeah, so that's why the <laughs> I think it looks good. Alan, Ellie, and Jimmy. Breeze board. Ooh, breeze board. That ain't, that ain't bad, Ronnie. Yeah, isn't this a cool barn? It's a pretty neat barn. I think this is so by far. I mean, the freestyle barn by far. I have the most time in and it, it, it's something I want and I'm going to be building more styles probably a little bit bigger because this is actually for a hundred cows this is actually pretty small um, like if you'd put a hundred cows in there it'd be really tight and this has the extra building like this isn't the one Giants has you won't see this one just yet uh, but yeah it's got the additional uh, freestyle barn to the side the one they have it doesn't have it side of the wall and then a manure trigger um, but yeah I want to make more with these old school barns like this and I don't know why my light fixtures are blue they're not or they're white they should be blue I need to figure that out but not a big deal uh, from above oh, looks <laughs> oh yeah wait we'll go up you're saying like this yeah, it's a real close cow yard. Then this is a cow pasture. I don't know if anybody knows that. Like, I put this together. Uh, I, I should redo this trigger. But I guess you'd have a little bit of spillage, wouldn't you? The cows would be pulling it out and whatnot. But yeah, so then there's this. And then Scooter kind of helped me with this. I didn't really know what I was doing. But uh, that was back when I was doing that kind of stuff. <laughs> But the fence is awesome. DR Modding has some sweet fence. Oh no, then this is a placeable. But it, it all came together. It looks, it looks pretty slick on this map, I think. Looks pretty awesome. May Farm is located at the small... Oh, my farm. Accurate in my area. Yeah, I, I mean, there's all color buildings. I mean, I've... 
I've always liked the look of the red barns. And that's why I made my barns red. But, like, these buildings are all color selectable. They're all... You can change the colors, but... Alright, let's let's dive right back in the stuff. I mean, I got kind of distracted. Where's the guy hauling manure? Where did he get to? Oh, gosh. He's hauling right on her. Hey, we ain't even bailed yet. What are you doing? Hey, thanks, Benny. How are you? I seen you comment the other day. He hauled all that manure and he's only 84%. Jeez, Louise. We're going to have mountains of manure. No, I mean the light beam. Oh, oh, well, yeah. Actually, they should be like a silver box, I would think. Like an outdoor old silver box. But. I, I should change them. I should make them like a galvanized. Let's get on this tractor. There's Rooster's new bale trailer. I don't know if for anybody that wasn't here earlier. That's his new bale trailer. Ben only holds big bales, not little bales. Pretty slick. Works really nice. So let's hook up this trailer. We need our wagon. We need it back out in the field again. What's the <laughs> capacity of that little poop flicker? Uh, I forget. It was a lot, though. Let me guess. We'll, we'll run out there and we'll hop on it there, Mr. Farqua. No, I don't think it is. It shouldn't be. It should just be pulling from what's in the little poop flicker. I don't... Uh, okay, one last thing. So in the freestyle barn, I did build this in. This is another reason I need to, as you can see, it terraforms the ground down more. But yeah, this is a slurry pit. So you back up or pull along here, and this will fill up. Uh, but it's supposed to simulate like you're going to scrape the cow yard, and you're going to scrape the cow manure in here, and then suck it out. Uh, that's That was the whole idea behind this. Little poo flicker. Let's get, let's check out this pool of poo flicker. Um, we got what? 475. Yeah, it's got a lot of it's got a lot of storage. It's got a lot of poo flicking storage. Okay, we got to turn this guy back into transport mode, operate mode. No, operate mode. Yeah, let's get this guy around. If he picks up the bales, we know we're good. Yep. Okay, let's hook up back to the baler. We'll bale cut more passes here. I guess I could pick up some more round bales. Don't really bother me any. Whatever you guys want to... kind of jobs you guys like doing. I'm just here to entertain y'all. I gotta head off. It's my turn. Night feed. My little man, my great Christian. Hey, see you later, Mr. Farqua. And then, yeah, keep an eye out. There might be some more mods. You never know. Uh, so, Benny, yeah, this is field. This is your starting farm. I just redid my fields and driveways and... Um, so this would be like the starting farm. You start with like this and this field. I just squared them up. And then like I said earlier, I, I'll, I plan to buy this and then make my field square like this. Because uh, I like square fields. But yeah, that's how my fields all look. Look at all them bales. Whew. All right, it's time to drop. Whee! Yeah, there we go. Yeah, and then hopefully more barns come out, and then you can, you know, grow the same way this one is. That's what's kind of neat about having the, uh, like, in game, even you guys that are playing on console, you know, you guys can build the way I build, if you prefer, if you'd like. We're going to bail ourselves another load here. 
<laughs> All right. See you later. Thanks for that. Mr. Farqua, you are a legend. Simulation, I don't know if you're still at Miss, uh, Simulation Station. Uh, when is the first stream coming to your channel? We're all wondering. Look at that beauty. Yeah, God. See, uh, for you console guys, you are all... Uh, to, for me to get this on console, I gotta get a computer software called substance painter so I can paint the dirt and the wear why is this I don't know why my uh, guy rakens all over the place but yeah so I'd have to get software like that to get proper dirt and wear and I've never used it so that's why I mean I would love to get something that po to that point Something like the D21 or even this. This is probably my second favorite Alice mod. Is the 8000 series. Yeah, what do you row crop? He did one time. It was pretty delayed because the internet stinked. But, uh, yeah, the guy's a legend. Legend. I like saying legend. Yeah, it is row crop. It's kind. Of, well, I was told you can use the free. I don't exactly know. I was told you can use the free, and then you just keep using the free. I don't. I, I don't know. I've never. I've never looked into it. I hate because uh, you can get a thirty-day free trial, but I hate to burn it up if I don't know what I'm doing or don't have mods. It's like the barns. I could paint like. Let's say like where the cows lick it off the paint. Like I could paint all that stuff on there. Like wear and or not really wear, but like distressed and moss and dirt on the barns, which I think would look awesome. But I don't want to have 30 day free trial and not be ready for it. I guess so. That's why I haven't really pulled the trigger on getting figuring it out yet. I got a little rake go, go over there. So you did you get your job switch row crop? Uh, have you have you gotten to your new job yet? So you're on days then. Yeah, the 8550. I guess I don't have that on here. The old 8550. It's how it really doesn't seem like. Uh, I did say it to JMF the other day, which I guess he has worked on some AC stuff. But I mean, just think if I wouldn't have came along and messed with the AC stuff, I wonder who would have done it. Well, that's yeah, that's good then. I have this D17 mod. I was gonna use. I have two. I have Scooty Pooties. If he's still in here. I don't know if he's... This is what him and I should work on and get it good. Um, but this, I think this is Shobin Moddings. I was going to use this as my mixer tractor, but I didn't. As the three-point arms weren't right, so I left alone. This is Alma, Missouri. This is on the in-game mod hub, James. Yeah, there you go. Real crap, has got you. You can play this no matter what you play on. We're pretty much bailing up our poop. Right over our poop. No good. I have to sell this to the neighbors or something. Right, uh, right on. This going to be a lot of little bales. Maybe we should round bale some. Because... The heifers work easier with the little round bales. Because I was thinking about getting a gator to move around the little bales once I unload them from the shed. But is there any other like little gator things out there that I can move little square bales around with that has like an auto load 
a little trailer or a little bed on it or something I mean that's what I'd like to get I mean I don't need a John Deere Gator but I could get one Yeah, do you, do you think, I wouldn't see why not, I guess. Let's say, do you think Giants would be okay with the, something they don't know anything about their scooter? I got 7,000 on here too. Uh, there are James. Got this, I got the one that, yeah, this one. I need to redo its back rims and tires. Uh, keep the spin outs, but give it, uh. Give it like the 8,000 rims as well. The old original 8,000. Mm -hmm. Scooter, remember helping me with this one? Gosh, I didn't know what I was doing then. No interior. Now look at this one. I got all the stickers for the front one, but I just need to do it. Oh, yeah, mule. Ah, maybe he did send. Ah, I don't have it. Send it to me. Uh, James, like I said, if you, uh, I, uh, to do the tractors or even equipment, I need to get substance painter to be able to put proper wear and dirt textures on it. I don't have it. So I would have to do that. Get that. And Scooter, why you call me the Mod Hub Modder? You're a Mod Hub Modder. You're way before me. Yeah, I thought that I would. This would. I didn't think I'd want to bail this much, but. We could cut to the other end. Maybe we'll get the round baler out. I'll bail the rest of it. I'll tell you one thing though, it does take some horsepower on these hills. Uh, oh, 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 I messed up. I hit the wrong button. I was trying to shift over a little bit. <laughs> uh, I know, James, and I really, I sit here and I think, I know Julian's the only one, or... Yeah, it's Julian F. Ma or Julian, whatever his name is, you guys know who I'm talking about. The guy that made the 8550. He's the only one that made anything AC, and it stinks. I mean, I, I mean, I, the D21 is, you know, the tractor I spent time on it. The guy shifts, the levers move, everything does what it's supposed to do. I just, I, I'd have to, I got to get substance painter to get to up to their standards, so. It's got to have its own custom stuff done to it. And that's why I've never pushed for more stuff. But I, I should. Hey, Levin. And James, like, definitely with releasing the buildings and, like, getting getting everything that far, it's neat. And it's something I, I definitely want to keep doing. So, oh, God, we're full. We're full. Let's not do like last time. Or one bale short, that's okay. We're two bale short, that's so okay. I know one thing Scooter absolutely loves here. It's those front fenders. Look at those babies. Ooh, dog. How could you not like them front fenders? Yeah, let's just leave this here. We got stuff scattered everywhere. It's okay, though. Let's go get the 7,000. Wee! Oop, sorry. I'm surprised he didn't fold, but... Let's clean up this. I had to square this corner off when I was... Driving to come by myself. Maybe we can get one more bale of straw out of here. <laughs> I 
<laughs> oh, you know you love the fenders. You're scooping the poop with the 4020. Now, see, that's the thing. Everybody likes to... Uh, everybody likes to diss on, like, EY modding. Oh, it's not scaled right. Eh, this, that, and the other. That guy has made so much stuff that never would have seen the light of day otherwise. Like, or... Or... What should I say? Not... not they couldn't, but I'm saying no one has worked on it, so... I'm happy that he did a lot of that stuff. I use that stuff. I think it's cool. Would it even be a stream if you didn't have... <laughs> yeah, you like them fenders, huh, hounds? Yeah. Who doesn't like this? Oh, look, I got fenders on this one, too. Yep. Gotta have some fenders. I mean, when you're cruising around in the rain, because who isn't farming in the rain or in the mud? You don't want that dirt flinging all over your precious paint job. Gosh, we're going to have to travel all around this field just to get enough straw. I don't think it matters, right? If I go into hay, it'll still puke out a straw bale, I think. I think. The back tires? These are actually the right size. These are 18 I believe. Yeah, 38s. So that's what size tire is supposed to be on it. 460s are, or that might actually be 169s. You might be a little bit right. They should be 480s. Um, 480, 80s, 80. Oh, I don't have the. I think it's. Uh, nope. Ah, what's auto unload? Z? There we go. The cab is wrong on the black frame. Is it because it should have the window in the back? And you gotta remember, I'm, I pieced this mod together when I didn't have a clue what I was doing like I do now. I've learned a lot. Oop. I wasn't paying attention. I was trying to read what everybody had to say. That's how I deal with it when I don't stop. I just turn. Like, I so wish you could just hire them and they could figure it out. Oh, I did see someone told me that. So you're saying black ones shouldn't have that bump out. Okay, I think there is a Alice that... Um, what's the guy's name? Blake. I think Blake. However you say his last name, Chambers, Cham, Chamness, or however you say it. He's got that version. But I didn't know that because I know somebody was saying too, like the 7080 doesn't have the air cleaner up front either. I actually ran a setup, a de uh, uh, no, it was a 66, it was a Claw 66, but it was a 7045 AC, just like this, with a, a round baler on the back of it. And I ran it right out of fuel. A guy was like, yeah, it's good to go, and then I went and took it, and then, what do you know, the stupid thing wasn't full on fuel, and it ran out. Uh, Blake's, there is a lot of mods he has that he's worked on that he hasn't released. So, yes and no, because he's released a lot of things. Like, the Kinsey Planner was originally his. He sent it to me to work on. Um, but, yeah, he usually releases most of everything unless he's not done working on it.
Balin. If you look up, uh, James, I'm assuming you're on PC. I would assume. Uh, he, th I forget what his page is. It's either old school farming or old, old iron farm. I forget what his page is. It's some Facebook page. I don't have Facebook, so I couldn't tell you. I just know that's what I've seen people say. It's either one or the other. Old school or something like that. <laughs> um, but Benny, both good. I mean, both I've... I've definitely tracked more hours on Richland so far, but I'm definitely tracking up hours on this map easy. I mean, it's so smooth to play. The town's freaking awesome. Uh, I like driving around, looking. I, I like the more square fields. That's why I made this field square, and I like the smaller fields. I mean, we might still have big field quantities of, like, corn and beans, but I like them being broke up a little bit. So yeah, either yeah, either map you really can't go wrong. Both real nice. I guess the one thing I like about this over high Richland, and it's not something I need, but I do like in a map is uh, is the town. I do like the town in this map, where Ohio Richland doesn't really have any town, which is fine. You're mowing the ditches right now, Kyler. Yeah, I had a batwing mower from a guy named Scooter, but I don't think I have it installed on this. I, I didn't install very many mods on this playthrough. I was trying to get back to my roots, back to the orange paint. I kind of missed it. I was playing with the green and the white uh, cases. Which was fun. I mean, I like the white farm too. That's a good, that's a real good map. Won't be hesitant to give that a try. Hey, see you later, Scooter. Have a good evening. Hit me up with some stuff if you need, you know, want to work on the D17 or you got that mule you'd like to share. We'll give it a try. And have a good dinner. I know I'm in the neighbor's field. It used to be our field. How you doing tonight, Jeremiah? I, I seen you come in a lot earlier, but I ain't seen nothing really out of you. You enjoying the new little cow shed? Yeah, my D21. On your alma play? Well, shoot, yeah, why wouldn't you? Shoot, yeah. We got it here, too. It's over there on the poo flinger. Oh, are we struggling? We're kind of struggling. We're using all the horses and the ponies. Well, I'm glad it's working out for you. That was a pretty nice, quick little building I put together. I'm excited to get the other. Uh, I, the freestyle barn's with them, so. But the. Uh, steer or the feedlot the little feedlot barn we need to get that out i think people will enjoy that it's just got that old feel to it um i mean these are my beans right here so yeah they're road yep sure does and i even planted those with a 15 inch planter the old kinsey eight row well with the inner cedar Yeah, I should go back. Like that mod, I could make that thing such a much smaller file size and just better all around. I just, 
I gotta pick and choose what I want to work on. That's the problem. I don't still have enough time. You're one of the big bar Yeah, I'm, I'm wanting people to have it too. I'm one <laughs> I'm really wanting people to They've had it since August 23rd. That's how long it's been with Giants. And each time they send it back to me. Send it back four times. And each time it's just silly stuff. And they could have just told me one time. Fix these 15 things. Which the 15 things aren't even really relevant. And, you know, we could have just fixed it all at once. Yeah, I've never played it, uh, Benny. I never played the real crop, uh, maps. I, I want to say I would probably want to try it at some point, but I'm not, I'm not in a hurry to get to it. I think, uh, JMF is brilliant. He's done a great job. Him and Squatch. Um, and whoever helped him else, I don't know actually who all helped, but I'd say give the, give them till winter, and then I bet that map will be they'll they'll have things so figured out, dialed in, zeroed out. Oh gosh, they'll be doing good. And then maybe I'll try it this winter when I got more times. I I think my biggest problem with their testing is it's like so the barn passed testing once before my last send back and then they sent it to me and said the person who or your barn has passed testing but the person who tested your barn is out for personal reasons so it's going to get sent to someone else for uh, testing and then they sent it back to me and said they didn't like the cows in the parlor and they didn't like the store image. They said my store image. Let's see. Uh, this has probably got the old store image in it, I think. Oh, it has no store image because I'm using the old school. Never mind. So they didn't like my store image. Which, I was like it already passed testing. But anyhow, so I had to go back and make new store images for it. Uh, I had to make new story images for it, and then they wanted me, told me to take the the cows out of the milking parlor, and I was sent them back. I was like, no, I'm really wanting to showcase, you know, what time milkings are going on, and it it, it needs to be for the old school feeling. So we'll see where it goes. I don't know what's going to happen. Uh, I don't think you'll find it under his name. You gotta look up, like, old school farming. Or old school modding or something. Oh, yeah. The, the big dairy barn, Benny, is already in testing. Have you seen Benny? Should I just go over there? Kyler feeding the cows at the 4440. Heck, yeah. I tell you what, we'll just leave that last pass right there. We'll leave all of our tractors out here in the hayfield. Tether. I mean, we got stuff scattered everywhere. So you guys have this barn, Benny. This barn is the one I'm currently trying to finish up. And then this is the barn that's in testing right now. Well, this is the barn that's in testing. This is an addition, which would be like an update. This would be an update. Oh, I don't, I don't know exactly James if he, I don't know how he does it, to be honest with you. Where he puts his name or whatever. Okay, let's, uh, let's do what I said I was going to do like an hour ago. Hey, we're just going to call you uh, Rough Rider. I'm back high school football game. Yeah, I kind of want you to, I want people to add it to their save game. Yeah, Rough Rider, I don't know what you are. Are you a bot or are you a person? 
I thought I've seen you in here before. So let's get a couple bales of straw out here. Straw, let's get about... Well, let's get two at a time. Maybe it'll be easier to stick them. Yeah, maybe it'll be easier. Oop, nope, 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 nope. Need to get over a little bit. There we go. Nice and steady, nice and steady. So who first? The Sears? The Bulls? Okay, so you come around here. You gotta open this. Don't get too close or it'll sling them like it did last time. Um, Rough Rider, do you play on PC? I tell you what I did. I'll tell you what I did, and it seemed like it helped a ton. And then the next question I have for you, if you do play on PC, is if you have a NVIDIA graphics card. Okay, we'll just leave that bale in there. As mine used to flicker bad, I hated it. But I've since kind of got it to tone down, like I would say, 98%. Or you could even look it up, um, tree flickering, farming simulator, something like that. And there'll be a guy who'll show you. You go in and you like disable your sh shader or something. You disable it and then it'll... Uh, I've had really good luck with it since then. Mine was bad. And yeah, mine PC's not even that old. So we'll bed the cows. Hey Lee Sutton, this is your first live stream. Well, you know what? Here's a shout out. Lee Sutton, he is new here, guys, so say hello to Lee. We'll bring these into the cows. I assume I can set both of them straight away in there. Yeah, look at this. And the straw trigger will go up. I don't know why that didn't fall down. There we go. Oh, I hit the wall. I was trying to read what Lee Sutton had to say. Let's shut the gate so the cows don't get on the road. Find this trigger again. Where are you? No, there you are. Okie dokie, let's get back in the skid loader. We need two more bales for the... Just did my first live stream. I just hit 128 subs today. Nice. Nice, that's real good. I kind of slacked off. I haven't streamed in like two weeks or something like 16 days or something I was like yep I need to get stream it was rainy ain't nothing much going on I wanted to start working on finishing up this barn but I was like you know what we need to be streaming let's get these bales in here you guys probably using this barn so you know how this works set them right down boom and then the other one's suspended in there. And then boom. So now we're going to have just poop everywhere again. Nice thing about having a nice tight yard is you can just park anything anywhere you want. These cows got feed? What kind of feeding situation? Hey, a, a, a Ron Kidder. Yeah, I don't know how to say what you want me to say. CFL, Sasquatch, Rough Riders, EST, 1910, Fran. Is that good enough? Let's check our food situation. We got food? They got food. I don't know why they don't have health. And they don't have health, but they have food. We can take a bail out to the heifers. We'll get one more bail. We'll run them out to the pasture cows. There you go. 
I told you we're just gonna call you a rough rider because I don't I don't know how to say any much more yeah catch you later rough rider let's grab uh, one bale a straw or hay for the pasture cows there we go Oop. run that out there real quick like once there we go open that gate it's gonna fling my because I parked too close even though I told you guys we shouldn't be doing that I forgot I want a name like that when I <laughs> Ronnie that's a big that's yeah uh, I tell you what, it takes a lot to handle a name like that. Yeah, I don't know why they're not gaining health out here because they don't have TMR, but I don't want them to have to have TMR. RR. Yeah, why the heck? I'm guessing you guys are probably feeding TMR though. So that's some males. I have no health. The calves have no. The only thing that has health is the. F yeah, that doesn't make any sense. To me. I mean, they should at least have. Uh, Sixty percent. I mean, they have productivity is fine. Is that all that matters? I don't know. Oh, I got it. No, I got it, Ronnie. I I understood. Why would you make it that long? I mean, I don't know. maybe he was going for something else and it was already taken, you know? So he's like, shoot, I'm going to make it as long as I can. I'm pretty sure he's been in here before. I think I've seen him in here before. I don't think I can park this skid loader in there. Bonk. Nope. Mm -mm. Where can I get a Demco gravity wagon? Ugh. Shoot, I don't know. I'm using the J&M by OS farms I kinda wanted to make this for like my so hear me out this silo is just a placeable but I've been thinking about putting a like little feed room huh what do you think I think a little feed room here maybe question mark I don't know mod hub I don't think they're you unless you're thinking unless you're thinking uh uh Demco grain cart not gravity wagon I think he said gravity wagon well watchdog there you are where you been buddy you've been working probably uh, what do we want to do pick up some more bales or something let's get the d21 you guys think of this rig look at this oh shifting yep oh shifting again one more time Let's put him on rooster's wagons. Woo! We about ran right into our corn. I always like to start in the farthest corner of the field. And work my way back, but... We gotta turn this on. We gotta hit reset. Right, then I oh, reset. There we go. Now we're loading. We swerve all around. Oh shoot, we're not gonna get any. I just kind of swerve at them. Watchdog. Let's get a shout out for a watchdog. He's a moderator. He is a legend. Yeah, he must have it, so put some back bales in first. That's pretty cool. He's been here a lot. Watchdog 33. How you doing, buddy? Have a good week? We're just picking up some bales. We made a bunch of them. Holy cranberries. We just ramped that. Pleasant, have you dabbled in map? <laughs> I have some map editing, not map making. 
Uh, Ronnie, I don't know how long you've been around, but when we were playing on uh, Mercer County, I was I, I dabbled in that map. And it's not something I might, I mean, I might work on more, but I've been working on the barns and stuff. Got ourselves a nice full load of round bales. Yeah, I was earlier here, Watch Star. That's why I've been in the house, but, uh, I don't know that it's raining right now here. You guys can keep the rain. I'm going to get out and shell corn. What if there's a place to sell bales? And, uh, maybe we might need these. Let's just unload them. Look at that. Look how Rooster does. He does a great job. Look at that. You just set them down. Boom. They're gone. Sneak through this barnyard. If you're good, you can sneak through real easy. You just, you just sneak through. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Let's hit reset. We should be good to go. Should be good. Oh, hold on. I got. I like the 4430 on Mercer. I enjoyed that one series you you some say oh I'm at very very beginning stage you wish me good luck really good luck oh yeah kill yeah we got corn ready they've been hammering down all week yeah I built this whole farm Levi uh, I didn't build all the barns that was shops legacies and then the other couple barns is from this map. I just changed them to red over being white. They were white. That's all I did. But yeah, I placed them all down and built the map. Or built the uh, farm for sure. Are we going to get all these straw bales on this load? You guys think? What do you think? Yeah? Yeah, we're going to get them all. We have to go pick up some hay bales. We totally missed that one. We were right in this ballpark and we totally missed it. Yeah, we might get a we might as well go get a couple hay bales and put on here. There we go. What do we think? Are we got them all? Yes, sir. Um Ohio? North? Uh, central. Central, west. About as west as you can get. Oh, I totally missed that bale. Let's pick up this one and we'll pick up that one. Oh, I can't even see what his profile pic is. It's just a little thing. I can't really see what his profile pic is. You guys got to share with me what it is. It looks like a John Deere combine or something. Oh, shoot. You're about an hour east from the main dairy on Mercer County. I'm about five, nah, I'm about ten minutes west, northwest of the dairy, that dairy. Oh, yeah, let's fast forward. Okay, we got everything done. Yeah, let's fast forward. Who's all around? Who wants to see some cows in the milk parlor? It's the coolest thing about this barn. Okay, we got time. It's only 10 o'clock in the morning. Man, I got... Oh, because I'm only playing at half speed. Let's just zoom ahead a little bit. So if we get to 6 o'clock... Wage payments. Jeez, I'm Pete's. Talk about highway robbery. Well, howdy, neighbor. Dakota, how are you? Jeremiah, some of you guys have already seen this, but I'll show it off. For those that haven't. 
So we need to get to 18 o'clock. So we got we got everything done, right? Got the hay almost all bailed, so it's fine. Yep, mm, should be good. Come on, milking time. Come on, let's go. Lights will kick on. The cows will come in. I wish I could. These cows would disappear. Nah, that I need to look into. I've been thinking about it, but I'm like, I don't know how to do it for sure. Come on, cows. It's almost milking time. Got a half an hour till milking. And you guys ready for this? Oh, I'm holding you guys off. What do you guys think? Ready? Oh, lights kicked on. Oh, where are the cow? Why are the cows aren't in here for? The lights kicked on. Well, dead gummit. Uh, static actor moved. Okay, no, that's not what I'm worried about. Well, now what the heck? Hmm. Give me one minute. I'm going to see if I can figure it out. No. You're going to lose sound, but I'm, I'm going to look into it real quick. Don't go nowhere. I don't have it. No, cows. Thirty-two, thirty-one, thirty, twenty-eight. Okay, I think I figured it out. Maybe. No, I didn't. Hmm. I thought it was because I had him. Hold on. Twenty-one, twenty-eight. Cow. Mm hmm. But voila, wasn't that worth it? Aren't you guys glad that you waited? I figured it out. Now, they don't move. They're just static. Because they're not actually part of the... What makes these cows move. They're their own thing, but... Yep, there's old Bessie. There's all the cows. Now, when it places, it shouldn't always have this. And actually, this might place this way because... I haven't messed with all the... Level triggers for this additional barn. But, yeah. So here's the milk cows. It'll be sweet. I need to find noise for it. Like the milkers. Yeah, I knew I could get it, Jeremiah. Alright, let's go around to the front side. We can get in the milking parlor that way. Morning, Bessie. Alright, well, evening, Bessie. How you doing? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, don't pay attention to this. I don't know why that's there. But yeah, we got the milk cows in the milk parlor. Now, technically, there'd be like some type of buffer gate here. And I need to redo the parlor. But... You still got your milkers. You got your cows in here. Yeah.
Yeah, I mean, why wouldn't you? I mean, this is how cows are. They get milked. This is how it is. Yeah, I need to redo this parlor. But otherwise, I mean, it looks sweet, don't it? I mean, if you played this game, wouldn't you want to? I don't know why she's walking through there. Oh, it's because I made the nav... I was I'm trying to make it so their heads would actually go in the bunks when they eat. Yeah, that's a little... That's what I'm trying to bring to the game. And then, anybody that ain't been here, I guess we can walk through the rest of the barn. This is your milk part. You know, you pull up here, and that's the trigger to load milk. Uh, you got your sink here to wash your hands. You got some, you know, stuff. In case you got, got your uh, tit dip and stuff for milking. You got your bulk tank, and then, yep, that opens up into there. This, now, this will take you up to the hayloft. Turn the light switch on. And then we got our bales up here. And if you want to get your bales out, you can open the door. You don't have to open the door, though, I guess. And then you can throw, let's just throw two bales down. And your bales wind up down there. Huh? The only thing I could think of is that, is, I think is, were there ratings? Random wool on the ground? Here? Wool? I don't know where there would be any wool. Wool? I don't know. Oh, so a lot of you guys probably haven't seen this barn then, have you? Yeah. Now, I wish the cows moved, but this is the best I could do. And I, w I wanted to put more in the, par in the back end of the parlor, but... I was trying to have to keep below the poly count, so. The only thing I thought, but they would always be roaming around in here, is just to make it so they roam around in here. But two, you can take these. I know Frosty had asked me about bales, so I made the bale trigger so you throw the bales in. He's always saying, he's wanting it, and I should just make it wider. But he's wanting to unload his bales over here like this. Because this is where the trigger is for it. The, the, it or it, it says unload feed here, but no, the bale trigger is here. That's how I have it. I should make it bigger for like bigger bales. That's how I should have it, but yeah. But these lights all work. Everything works. The lights all work. In here, you come back inside. Let me through the door. And there's a light switch here. You can. It. It's supposed to look better than that, but. I didn't, the textures, it's, it's the thing, but, yeah, then all these lights will kick on. The parlor lights kick on and off when it's milking time. So these lights come on, and those lights in there come on when it's milking time. They kind of look good, but they kind of don't. So, yeah. Yeah, I know, Watchdog, it's, it's, it's a sweet barn, I just. So then this, this should have, I'll, don't think I have it yet, but where well, you can put straw in here too for the cows. So yeah, I hate to show off something sweet and then have to end the stream, but I've been streaming for a little while and I'm starting to get tired because I get up at two in the morning to feed my real life cows. So I'm going to leave you guys with this nice barn. I appreciate everybody that's been here. I can't even believe there's 60 people watching. Can I even leave at this point? If I get 10 people to say you want me to stay on, I'll stay on for an, a little while longer. We'll find something to do. 60 people watching. I can't even believe that. Stay. I just got here. Stay. <laughs> So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So there is people here. I was like, there's no way 60 people. What do you guys want to do? I got a little bit of time. We can stream for a little bit longer. Uh, 
We guess we could finish up this baling. We'll get the little egg co up front. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I got a little bit of time. We'll get we'll go in a little bit longer. For the guys that got this guy here. Yeah, hey, there's Kyle. He's back. Hey Kyle, Fairview Farms. How you doing, buddy? Did you make it home good, Kyle? Hopefully all went well. I like this rake, how it holds up. Really just takes up no space. Is there anything you guys are wanting to see that you haven't seen yet? Uh, I showed the steer barn off like 50 times because I love showing it off. Park this guy right here. We'll run back out here. We'll get on to Alice. <laughs> Doug, you've been here the whole time. Oh, you've been here quite a bit, Doug. I've seen you in here before. I appreciate you. I appreciate all you guys. Oh, it didn't sound like my bailer was on, but I guess it is on. Yeah, do all that stuff. Like, comment, subscribe. Go check out my barn on the mod hub if you're playing the game. Don't matter if you're on console or not. Go download that thing. See what you think of it. Let me know. And just, I mean, more should be coming. Giants willing. For this map, Kyle? Oh, you haven't played Alma yet? Alma's good. Um, let's show you the PDA quick. This is the PDA. I, I own this just little section. This is probably next, but this is the town. You haven't played this map, Kyle? We could go to town. Town's sweet. I don't even have a pickup. We'll just have to fly to town, I guess. You love the gleaners, Frank. All right, Frank, yeah. It's a shame I didn't like fully finish them and they got released prematurely, but the second version's so much better than the first version. You're in the bottom left. Oh, I thought you were up above me. Uh, Ky Kyler. Oh, thanks, Monty. Yeah. Hopefully that new barn works out pretty good. It's not a big barn. I mean, it's it's more just for the young cattle, which you know, sucks for the guys on console because you don't have enhanced animals. That's what I really built it with 30 calves in mind, not really 30 big cows, but you kind of get the idea still. Yeah, we'll, we'll take this last pass off and then we'll go to town real quick and we'll go go check out town there we go got that bail THG how you doing glad to have you back glad to have you back I think you went to dinner or something no I don't think so I think it's just a PC only mod it's on the in-game mod hub but I think it's only for PC I guess they said it works on Baylor Springs, I, I believe, is what I've heard. Yeah, it looks kind of cramp. Yeah, I know. Like I said, it, the intention was for the little calves. And I was trying to make it hold enough that it would be a good enough size barn for, like, a decent, a decent sized dairy to use for calves, basically. But they kind of wanted to make it so you could feed milk, but you'd have to have a map that allowed milk as a as a food. But you know, you you don't have to put that many in there. 
Okay, let's go to town. I got... No, I don't have a flight on. So we live here, Kyle. And then there's this little draw of a field in here. I guess it's all pretty based off real life. I think. The DEM is and everything. But you got your train track and you got all these little cut up fields which is neat and kind of like fence rows in my mind that's what they are fence rows but here's town so this is the train selling spot that i oh why don't i just turn on interactive zones duh okay but let's come into town this is like the mill i don't i never use this one i'm guessing this is like a sell point too but the town is awesome you come into town and you got cars parked along the side of the road. People taking off. And like it looks like it goes on. Like you just could get on that road and just keep right on driving. I mean you got. They said most of these buildings are modeled after real life buildings and stuff. So. I believe it looks good. I've never really checked what these things do. Buy building tail. Oh, these are all productions. Oh, okay. Pizzeria. All right, yeah. I guess this is like a post office or something. That's what it reminds me of. It's like a post office. Oh, that'd be sweet to have all those little. I'm not a production kind of guy, but I like the noise. The noise sounds good. Yeah, this is a console. Yeah, this is in-game mod hub. And then I think I don't know what this is. So I'm guessing this is where you can sell your dairy. This is where you can get some nice bread. Oh god, they got some nice bread there in the window. Ooh. But I know this is a vehicle shop. I've already uh, customized my tractors and stuff there. That's a bakery. Yeah, bakery. And I think... I forget where your equipment spawns. Is it here? No, I don't know where it spawns. Custom logo. I love it. That's sweet. Yeah, it's, I mean, the town is awesome. Maybe this is where your equipment spawns. Maybe here. I don't know where it spawns. Loyal Livestock. Register here. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, yeah, this is all. Awesome. Yeah, so this would be where you bring your kettle. Yeah, I was going to get off, but then everybody was like, one more hour. Well, I'm not staying on one more hour, but uh, everybody wanted me to stay a little bit more. So I haven't really got to explore the town, so Kyle hadn't seen it, so I just decided to come on up here. Guessing you got a little production here for some methane or something that says methane. Uh, that is loud. Ooh. What's this say? Popcorn. Oh, I did see people talking about popcorn factory. Should have a noise of like a popcorn popping in the microwave. That would have been awesome. <laughs> oh, another custom ketchup. Yeah, maybe this is the ketchup factory. Yeah, wonder what it takes to make ketchup. Is he, we don't have tomatoes. Like, even up here, you could build yourself a nice little farm. You know, this here's a nice little driveway. Just boom. Build yourself a nice little farm back up in here. Some neighbors. Some littler field. Or you can make these some pretty little fields. Yeah, the custom buildings are sweet. What I like is you can place everything. Um, like, building-wise. I think this is like a manure selling spot. Think. Oh, it's a salt. Oh, salt. Duh. Wood. <laughs> I just seen the manure. Or I guess I thought this was. Uh, I would say this has been. Oh, they're wood chips. Okay, this is log and stuff. Hey, <laughs> you're wanting to use that row crop ready stuff. With these big fields, you ain't gonna want to worry about that. You get yourself a big old John Deere 24 row planter. Look at this field. You know how long this would take me, you with a 12 row planter? 
You ain't gonna wanna do that. I could see myself if I was gonna farm this. I would just clear these fences, or these trees out, and just ride to the uh, train track and back. Mm hmm. I don't know that there's really anything more south of town. There's some houses, but. Yeah, you can see it's a, and the border's awesome. Like it just looks like you could just drive off and keep right on driving. Twenty-four rows, holy cats! We got somebody out here just driving around all wild and crazy. Yeah, everybody just twenty-four rows. Man, that's huge. That's huge. I did add this stuff in. It is some decor. Spruce up the place a little bit. Then you got Legacy's Shed here. Just awesome. Guy's a legend. And Rooster's nice trailer he let me use. This is... I think he said he just submitted this to Giants. Yeah, this PC is going to blow up. Alright guys, but in all seriousness, I really do appreciate everybody for watching and everybody that's been here the whole time. Uh, it's probably been one of my longest streams ever. I just had the time, so uh, I appreciate you. If you didn't hit the like, which you probably have. Go ahead and hit that. Hit the subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next one. Thank you.